Baby. Hey, I'm ready now. Wake up, wake up, somebody said you're back. What do you want now, damn it? What? Really? Hit me with the super bass. Okay, I'll hit you with the super bass. You got it? Yeah. Got bass guitar. I just send you a lead guitar. That's better. Paul Meets World was just here. What is up, YouTube? How y'all doing? Yeah. Saturday Night Live, my main man Christopher asked for Saturday Night Live on this Patron Sunday, Super Bowl Sunday, man. Give him a thumbs up. This Saturday Night Live right here, man. Fire safety. Without any further ado, y'all hit that subscribe button. Hit that bell. Let's check it out. Captain Lemke from the Irvine Fire Department. He's going to be talking to you today about holiday fire safety. So please stay focused and curb the wiggling. I'm going to go sit in my car and eat this bag of baby carrots. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Good morning, Captain Lemke. You guys excited for Christmas? Heck yeah. Santa Claus, baby. All right. <laughs> so what can we do to be fire smart this season? Unplug your Christmas lights at night. Remind your parents to test their smoke alarms and always keep a safe distance from the fireplace. Whoa, hold up, man. This fireplace is where the toys come down. Mm, I love me some toys. Yes, but the fireplace is still very dangerous. Now, now I know you're excited about Santa coming down that chimney, but on Christmas Eve, what are you going to do? I'm going to get in that fireplace. Get those toys. <laughs> Don't do that. Don't do that. I just said the fireplace is dangerous. Does that mean Santa's in danger? Well, no. Santa's different. He has, you know, special magical powers that protect him. Captain Lemke, do we have that same magic? Only one way to find out. Get in that fire, see if you burn. Oh, no. Please don't do that. <laughs> well, you're right. I'm going to see if my pets have magic first. No, 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 just, right. just forget about the magic thing. Fire hurts everyone, even Santa. So Santa is in danger. I don't know. Just be careful around the fireplace. Well, hold up, man. You expect me to just chill out, snug in my bed, and let this saint slide down my chimney into a fiery death trap? That is messed up, man. Yeah, that, <laughs> that seems is evil, up, Captain Limkey. So what do we do? Throw on some thick shoes and get in that fireplace so you can give Santa a heads up. Yeah, good idea, Shallon. No, don't do that. <laughs> I'm sorry, what's your name? It's yeah. Shallon. Shallon's idea is terrible, but she's very loud, so it's throwing you off. Do not go into your fireplace on Christmas Eve. Slow it down, Backdraft. Now, Santa's my boy, okay? And I have been borderline <laughs> naughty this year. I owe it to him to get in that fireplace. I'm also going to get in my fireplace, sir. Stop obsessing about the fireplace. Don't get mad at us, man. You planted this fireplace seed. Well, what if we don't have a fireplace? I mean, how can I impress Santa? Get on that roof. Grab some glow sticks. Help him land that sleigh. He'd be like, oh, thanks, man. <laughs> Do not go on your roof. If you want to do something nice for room. Santa, surprise him with some milk and cookies. If you really want to surprise him, you can hide in the oven where the cookies are. Oh. Or hide in the refrigerator where the milk is. I'm going to hide in a dry cleaning bag. <laughs> dry cleaning bag. Stop it. Everybody be quiet. You, 
you did this. Yeah. Come up here. It's Shelby, right? Uh, sort of way off. It's Shallon. I want to make sure you understand a very simple con concept. So Shallon here is going to play out a little scenario. Please pay attention. <laughs> Let's pretend it's Christmas Eve at Shallon's house. Oh, cool. You play my mom's new boyfriend? Merry Christmas to you, Carlos. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not Carlos. I'm not in this. Now, Shallon, you see a fire in the fireplace. What do you do? I jump in there and be like, I sacrificed myself for you, Santa! I sacrificed well, myself for you. Fire. Oh, yeah, then I call you. Hello, fireman. Come to my house. I'm on fire. No, this whole thing is to avo avoid involving the fire department. Well, who am I supposed to involve? I am on fire. Well, stop being on fire. Then come to my house and pull me out. I don't want to come to your house. Do your damn job, you coward. You're letting a child burn. <laughs> Do your Stop job. drop and roll! Stop drop and roll! Santa's safe! It's a Christmas miracle! <gasps> Shallon overcame a corrupt fire department and saved Christmas, you guys! Shallon! 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 Well, I'm leaving now. Sadly, it looks <laughs> like you'll all, I'll all be seeing you on Christmas Eve. Mm-mm-mm. Wow! Uh -oh. Look at this. Last carrot. That time's out perfectly. Let me guess, they broke you. I blame you. Well. Miss Finley, can we play with matches? Hey, well, that's my policy on matches. Do it, Do it outside! Have fun. Go. <laughs> Do it outside. You know my policy on matches. Do it outside! <laughs> and have fun. Man, that's crazy, man. Saturday Night Live. I remember watching that thing, man. I don't watch it that much no more. I don't even know what channel come on. I don't watch TV. Hey. I'm going to get on up out of here. Y'all take a like, take a slow, tell them Mike Cross. Hold you so. Peace out. Don't go up the fireplace.